Hey guys, today I have a quick video for you on how to use Studio One's marker functionality. I'm not talking about just hitting the, the plus key here and adding a marker. I'm talking about how to use it to navigate quickly through a song, which is, um, which is pretty cool. And there's a couple of ways to do it. So let me show you. So first you've got your marker channel here. You hit, you can engage and disengage by hitting this flag. So we're going to keep it engaged. And the first thing I want to show you is as you go along in the song, you can actually either hit the Y key or Shift Y, and that'll insert a marker. So Shift Y will insert a marker and allow you to add a label. So if I'm going along here, and I want to add a label, I hit Shift Y, and I say Intro, and boom, there's my marker. So if you're listening to a song and you find a trouble spot, you get used to using that shift y command and you can you know it's pretty pretty cool to to uh, be able to mark spots within your song but you know if you generally what i do is i go through a song i i know where the chorus and the verses are and stuff so i'll basically go through and i'll just basically hit y and i'll or shift sorry shift y to, let me just do the shift y it makes it easier shift y and do um verse And then we'll go to here, and we'll, we'll call this the chorus. And then we'll call this another verse. Sorry. Okay. So now I've got my markers um, set up, and I can actually navigate to these in a couple of ways. The first way, which is the way I use most, is the tab key. And the tab, if you hit tab, it basically brings you to the next marker. Boom. If you want to go back, and it'll take you all the way to the end marker. Okay? If you want to go back, hold down the shift key, and it takes you back through. That's To me, that's the quickest way to get through a song. It really is. I mean, boom. You can get there within a couple of clicks. So that's that's a pretty cool way to do it. The other way to do it is you can go to up here, transport, go to marker, and you can see these are all marked. You can have up to, like, these are eight eight positions now this is great but the only problem is it, it, it's great to do it this way but if you, you can also use the numeric keypad you can see over here it's showing the number right the only problem with this is it starts at three right so it kind of it's kind of confusing because you would think that you would want the one to be the start and then two the second and the three but i understand why it probably the, i think numeric one and two do something else so you can't use those keys but I generally don't use the the numeric keypad at all because um, it's it's just difficult for my brain to process. Sorry about that, but it just just is. Like I said, you can so you can go here and, and if you want to go to the chorus, boom, it takes you right to the chorus. Or I'm using the numeric keypad now. I can do it that way too. Okay, but like I said, the best way I found to do it is the tab. I mean, look how quick that is. Okay, um, and that's. Um, that's pretty much it. Just a quick, quick uh, little tidbit on how to navigate through a song in Studio One. I hope this was helpful. Please comment, subscribe, and hit the like button if you like. Well, thanks for watching, and uh, have a great day.